Welcome, everyone, to a new season of the NBA. I'm sure you're as excited as all of us at 2K Sports are as we get ready to start the season in style. Moments away, it'll be the Phoenix Suns up against the Golden State Warriors here in Chase Center. I'm Brian Anderson. With me tonight, Grant Hill and Richard Jefferson with Ali LaForce joining us courtside. Here's a look at what's coming up for the Golden State Warriors. On Friday, they head out on the road to face the Kings in Sacramento. And then on Sunday, they'll be matching up with Victor Oladipo and the Houston Rockets. The road is never the highlight of your schedule for any team. But for these guys, it is a chance to go out there, test themselves, and see how well they gel outside of home court. It could be a very valuable experience. So let's take a look at the Phoenix Suns starting lineup. All the stars on the floor for the Suns. Booker and Beal, the backcourt, and KD up front. Grayson Allen is out there with Yusuf Nurkic. And for Golden State, the core of the Warriors' dynasty on the floor. Curry and Clay is the guards with Draymond at the four. Kevon Looney is out there with Andrew Wiggins. Well, there may be a lot of games ahead, but game one of the regular season is always a little extra special, Grant. Yeah, no question about it. This is a game everyone looks forward to. To start the season off on the right foot. I can't tell you how huge it is for a team's confidence to get a win on opening night, but it's definitely one everyone is looking forward to. For three, Durant. He drops it from range. And Durant three focuses points. on taking high percentage threes, which is why he's so efficient from there. Curry passes to Thompson. Now here's Green. And he drops in the layup off the glass. Just taking it right to the rim. And no one was there to greet him. Easy possessions like that literally are just a gift. You just dream of them. He'll gladly take those. And so it's Booker with it. He brings it up for the Suns. Nurkic to screen on Curry. Outside Booker. Pass to Durant. Six to shoot. And here's Nurkic for three. Rebounded by Green. Outside Curry. Launches it from deep. Doesn't go that time. And you never want to give a shooter like him a clean look. From behind the arc. And that's good. Kevin Durant for three. Durant's got six points. Of all the things that Durant is great at, that pull-up shot is up there. It's devastating if you're a defender. Looney, a screen on Booker. The three from Curry. The offensive rebound. And he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. Everyone in the building saw the obvious contact. At the line for the Dubs, Kevon Looney. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. First free throw is good. Well, Coach Kerr calls him the moral compass of the Warriors team. Kevon Looney has been a cornerstone, RJ. He knows his role. It's defense, rebounding, and setting screens, and he does his role at an elite level. He's a connector in the locker room, and everyone knows that Loon is that guy. He does not get the second one. When it comes to Golden State over the last 10 to 15 years, what stands out to you the most, RJ? Just the fact that you can never count out the Warriors. Every time they've gone through adversity, they seem to come out of it even stronger. And that one drops for him. Yeah, in the paint, Nurkic can be a monster. He's got all the physical gifts he needs to dominate. Here's Curry. Pass to Looney. Here's Green. Inside. Ooh, stolen by Allen. 
to the paint. Here's Durant. And that one goes in as he's fouled. It'll be three points if he converts the free throw. Well, Richard, Kevin Durant has been a big-time scorer in the NBA since he stepped onto the hardwood. No, and I played against him as a rookie. And let me tell you, even the veteran team that we had, we knew that this guy was going to be a bucket getter for a long time. Free throw, no good for Durant. One of the most accomplished players in the game. Durant's sole focus is to continue contending for titles. And a deep three from Curry. Rebounded by Nurkic. The Suns have gone four of five so far. Looking sharp. Fades and shoots. That's good from Durant. On the assist by Beal. Beal's got three assists tonight. <laughs> I just love the ball movement. And a little over two and a half minutes gone here in the first. Pass to Looney. Now here's Curry. Booker defending. And it's Stephen Curry with the three. Just another day at the office for Mr. Curry. Booker against Curry. First quarter of play, and we're about three minutes in. Nurkic a screen on Curry. Booker for three. Drains the triple. Getting out to a nice lead. Great flow and great execution. And so Curry will bring it up for the Warriors. They trail by nine. Looney finds Curry. Outside, Green. To the middle. Here's Wiggins. Soft touch off the glass. Ooh, that's a nice take from Wiggins. You could see his eyes light up when he got that position. Curry against Booker. Nurkic a screen on Curry. Nurkic passes to Allen. A chance to push it to double digits, but it's off the mark. Curry, he's open. Again, the Warriors score. Such a quick release. As soon as the ball touches his hands, it's gone. Booker against Curry. The three ball. Looney grabs a miss. Golden State has gone one of four from deep. They've been taking care of business. Especially at the offensive end, where they've been totally in sync. Looney, a screen on Booker. From deep three-point land. Curry, no good. He just looks off this quarter. Looks like he's forcing it a bit right now. A little bit in his head. Pass to Nurkic. Booker surveying the floor. Nurkic, a screen on Curry. Booker, the pass to Nurkic. Shot clock at five. Sinks it from distance. This speaks to the confidence Beal has in himself. Terrific work catching and firing off the catch. Wiggins outside. Looney, a screen on Allen. Wiggins passes to Looney. And Nurkic with the block. And he recovers it. And here's Curry. Wiggins outside. Shoots over Allen. Wiggins, no good. For Phoenix, they've gotten seven of their ten shots to fall. Durant against Curry. Durant, pass to Booker. Nurkic with the ball. The kick to Durant. Puts up a three. Warriors with the rebound. Looney's got rebound number five here tonight. Things just don't seem to be clicking for them offensively. Yeah, they really need to find a way to get back on track. Looney, a screen on Allen. Here's Wiggins, bearing his second of three attempts. This is where Wiggins can be really effective. His mid-range game can really do some damage. Curry against Booker. Nurkic, a screen on Curry. For three, Booker! Looney grabs a miss. Looney's got six rebounds here tonight. Green with a screen on Booker. Curry from deep three-point land. Sinks it. What range from downtown. The minute that Steph Curry steps into an arena, 
He is in his range. Pass to Booker. Nurkic to screen on Curry. Here's Booker. Count it. Two for four from the field now. Obviously, this guy has a talent for scoring. Able to problem solve for whatever the defense tosses at him. Here's Curry. Give him eight. Looney with the ball. Defended by Nurkic. Looney passes to Thompson. There's the three. And it's Phoenix with the rebound. Beal right side. Back to Duran. Looney grabs a miss. Looney's got his seventh rebound of the game with that last one. Green finds Curry. Green with a screen on Beal. Launches it. And Curry is good for three. Curry's got 11. Defensively, you have to be aware of Curry in that set. Phoenix calls timeout. The shocker of the 2023 trade deadline. Kevin Durant moving to the Suns, RJ. And then the shocker of the summer, adding Bradley Beal. Now they have a mean trio when you add him with KD and Book. I'm a fan of front offices going for it. Put all your chips in the middle. Let's go get a title. out there and checking the 2k leaderboard these teams led the league in three-point percentage last year the Warriors second they ran a great system last year that put a priority on creating high quality looks from deep and it made them the best three-point shooting team in the league Gordon outside. Pass to Little. Clock at six. Here's Goodwin. From outside, off the mark. So far, rebounding has been a focal point for them. Outside Paul. And he lobs it up to the rim. That ties it up. You create shots as easily as Paul does for his teammates. He is just a great setup guy. The Suns have got 8 of 15 shots to go. Here's Goodwin. He's guarded by Paul. Goodwin passes to Gordon. Takes a three. Buries it from three. And the Suns lead by three. Pick works well there, but the defense left a lot to be desired. Yeah, that just comes down to a lack of effort. The defender has to do a better job fighting through the screen. Pass to Goodwin. Now here's Bold. Gordon outside. And the whistle blows. It's going to be on Jonathan Kaminga. That's his first foul. Second team foul. Yeah. 
Here's Goodwin. He's guarded by Paul. And stolen by Paul. Pass to Pajemski. Here's Jackson Davis. And here's Sharich from deep. He's in his comfort zone. Two for two to start this one. And the defense is really allowing them too much room on the perimeter. Outside Little. They set a pick. Shot from 12. It's hauled in by Sharich. Looked like he just rushed it there. Just maybe take a little bit more time in the future. Pass to Paul. Just five on the clock. Fires from deep. Phoenix grabs the miss. Gordon with it. There's a screen by Metu. And he was fouled in the act of shooting. Opportunity for a three-point play here. Got his man all tangled up. I mean, serious crossover. All right, a look at how the points have been generated so far. A scoring breakdown for the Suns. They've really been dialed in from deep. This is a team that has a ton of confidence in their outside shooting ability. Another thing they're doing well early on is moving the ball, playing selfless basketball, and getting everybody involved on the offensive end. And for a while, it seemed the Warriors were maintaining a dual timeline approach. But not anymore, Grant. No, sir, B.A. The Warriors setting their clocks and calendars to coincide with their superstar. One Wardell Stephen Curry. Now here's Paul. He's scoreless. And he felt like he needed a little bit more space with the fade to get off his shot. But that might have been what threw him off and made him miss. Pass to Gordon. Here's Metu. Back to Gordon. There's a screen by Metu. Tries it from 19. Again, the Suns good for two. 119 left to play in the first quarter. Paul taking his time here. Shara to screen. The shot. Paul with the bucket. The ageless wonder. Paul's jump shot has only gotten better over time. Gordon outside. Goodwin passes to Metu. Gordon outside. Takes a 13-footer. And the rebound goes to the Warriors. Pass to Paul. Outside Kaminga. 36 seconds left to play in the first quarter. Paul for three. That won't go either for Paul. And with his team trying to trim this margin, his struggles this quarter, eh, they're not helping things. Here's Gordon. Pajemski grabs the board. Ooh, I think he wants that one back. I mean, he knows he's capable of better. The kick out to Paul. Shara to screen. Another shot. Paul with the bucket. Uses the pick so nicely. Paul gets the screen and fires away. Kevin Durant has been leading the charge for the Sun. He put together 10 points in the quarter. We'll be right back. We hope you're enjoying the game. Both teams tonight keeping things pretty even on the scoreboard so far. All right, guys, what stands out to you from the Suns in this one? Oh, what I love was that first quarter was all about leaking out and capitalizing in transition. It leads to some easy buckets, and I think it's given them control of the pace in this one. Now 
And so it's Golden State with it. They trail by one. When this one's in the books, they'll be off to Sacramento, taking on the Kings. It'll be the start of a three-game trip on the road. Down low, it's Draymond and Looney. Gary Payton II is out there with Chris Paul, and it's Kaminga in at the three. That's the group for Golden State as we kick off the second quarter. He's undersized for a four, but his hops level the playing field. Booker against Paul. Fires high post. Looney grabs a miss. You gotta love how they've been crashing the boards, fighting hard for every miss. Outside, green. Down low. Here's Kuminga. Kuminga soars in for the slam. Man, he makes it look easy. Something he's worked on over the years. Green is an elite passer. And so it's Booker with it. He brings it up for the Suns. It's a three-point game. And from the sideline, let's catch up with Allie. Devin Booker knows that fame comes with downsides. He said, quote, I'm on the bigger stage, so there's going to be more haters. That's life. But every day I wake up grateful for the opportunity to play. Back from being the little kid who wanted to be in the NBA, I have never lost sight of that. That's what keeps me going. Brian? Okay, Allie, thank you. Good stuff. Peyton's shot is good. <laughs> That's how you up the ante. Come right back at him. Yeah, I love the competitive fire right there. You drain a triple on us, and I'm coming for my revenge. Shoots from 12. Rebounded by Green. The Warriors have gone 3 of 3 to begin the second. Pass to Kaminga. And a foul called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. Looking at the young forward, Jonathan Kaminga, a big man who continues to try to get better. Yeah, I really like this guy. Ultimately, he's got to hit his 10,000 hours. He's got to play more games and get more minutes, but he definitely possesses a hunger to improve, and every team loves those types of values. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And he drops the first. And Grant, these days, more and more teams emphasize the importance of switch defense. It's so true in the modern NBA, B.A. Every team has to be able to switch to take away a lot of the action of the offensive team. So having defenders who can guard multiple players on the court is a must. Both good from the line that time. Phoenix has gotten 6 of 13 shots to go from outside the arc. Booker, the pass to Lee. Pass to Durant. Oh, KD, just oblivious to the opposition. If you feed KD, this man is going to do this all night long. Booker against Paul. The three from Curry. And that one goes. He's shooting five of nine in this one. You like how their perimeter game is building out. They're feeling it right now. Pass to Eubanks. Back to Booker. Let's the three fly. And the Suns get another three. What focus from Booker. He was dead set on hitting that three-point answer. And there's the lob. <laughs> and the lead increases on a crazy offensive yes. sequence. Man, the dunk alone would have been incredible, let alone the fact that it came off a pinpoint pass. Phoenix has gone 7 of 14 from the perimeter in this one. Booker for three. The kick to Durant. Six on the shot clock. Yep, count it. Durant's got 14 points for the game. Golden State has gone two for two from the arc here in the second. And there's a pick. Paul passes to Curry. Let's it go from deep. The Suns clear it. Just enough of a shot contest to bother him. Durant against Paul. 
Pass to Booker. Booker! Just shredding the D. The top scorers in the league, guys like Booker, they get buckets when it's hard. The Warriors have gotten five of their first six attempts to fall in the second. Here's Jackson Davis. Here's Kaminga. Allen defending. Unloads. Kaminga's shot is off. The Suns trailing. Up top, Durant. Can't get the go-ahead bucket. Outstanding work to send him away. They sniff that one out. Jackson Davis. It's good. The assist that time from Paul. Jackson Davis has got four points in the quarter. And Phoenix shooting has been good. Around 52% from the field. Time, out, time, time called out. here. The Suns decide to talk it over. Well, Grant and his Hall of Fame resume, just about the only thing missing for Chris Paul is the title. And he had a shot in Phoenix, but while Golden State perhaps not the favorites, with these other future Hall of Famers, I think the opportunity remains. Of Nurkic. He's checked in for Eubanks. Metu comes in for Allen. And it's Bradley Beal in for Lee. Metu, pass to Durant. Now here's Beal, defended by Thompson. Beal, no good. And it's Green with the ball for Golden State. Three-point lead. Pass to Curry. Jacks up a three. And that one's good. And Green with the assist. Green's got three assists tonight. And they've really been more consistent from the field this quarter. Curry against Booker. To the inside. Here's Matu. Always a nice way to start. Makes his first one. Booker just keeps getting better at orchestrating the pick and roll. Setting up his teammates out of those sets. The Warriors have gotten seven of their first nine shots to drop during the second. Curry passes to Looney. Oh, look at Looney at the rim. He gives up a bit of size at the center position, but his leaping ability, well, let's just say that makes up for it. For Phoenix, they've gone 6 of 11 here in the second quarter. Durant surveying the D. That one's good. 7 for 10 now. The Warriors leading. Here's Curry. 17 points in the game. Out to Thompson. From outside the arc. Oh, Thompson buries the tray. You just can't let Clay find any looks anywhere from the three-point line. He makes quick work from the coffin corner. Phoenix has gone 7 of 15 from distance in this game. 
Booker against Curry. Durant, the pass to Booker. Back to Durant. And the shot counts. He's fouled, and it's a chance for a three-point play. First team foul. All right, guys, what do you think about the offensive approach we've seen so far for the Warriors? The ball movement has been outstanding so far. They've come out of the gate looking for that extra pass. And not only that, they're off to a pretty hot start shooting from outside. They seem locked in tonight. Grant, usually the Suns rack up lots of assists. They're a team that values ball movement. Oh, B.A., that's how you create quality looks, by snapping the ball around. It also tells you something about how selfless these guys are. Here's Pajemski, still without a bucket. Gordon outside. Stolen by Wiggins. Pass to Pajemski. The kick out, Curry. They double-team Curry. Here's Garuba. Five on the clock. From downtown, easy money for Stephen Curry. And this has become expected from Curry. Everyone knows how dangerous he is at getting to his spots and capitalizing. Gordon finds Booker. Now Durant. From deep three-point range, Pajemski grabs the board. And after connecting twice from deep in the first quarter, he hasn't been able to drain another here in the second. Pass to Moody. Wiggins with it. It's hauled in by the Suns. Allen outside. Now Booker. Pass to Bull. Allen outside. There's the triple. And it falls. Two for three from the field so far. When he gets a quality look like this at the perimeter, he can almost be automatic. Now Curry. The three is up. Oh, he drains the three. And he'll go to the line for one more. And it's going to go on Devin Booker. Defensive foul. You know, when you look back on Stephen Curry's career, it's still amazing that he fell to the seventh pick of the draft. You think a few teams regret that one, B.A.? Look, as great as a shooter as he is, teams were scared off by his build because he didn't have that typical NBA strong body. One shot. And with a single punch in last season's training camp, it seems the Warriors' culture of joy and togetherness really took a hit, Grant. You know, I agree, B.A., and that's what they need to recover from. You know, keeping that connection and commitment to a common purpose is so crucial to winning. That's his second triple this quarter after hitting one earlier. This is how you space the floor. And here's Thompson. He'll bring it up for Golden State. It's a five-point game. Pass to Curry. Right side green. And they call an illegal screen That's here. Great. You're not going to fool the officials too often on an illegal screen. That's a very avoidable turnover. you got to focus on the details. Phoenix has gone four of six from outside. Looking sharp here in the second. Now here's Booker. He's guarded closely. Outside bowl. Three-pointer. Jackson Davis grabs a miss. And the Warriors shooting 56% today. Pass to Pajemski. Now Sharich, guarded by Durant. Charge the pass to Moody. 
Oh, Moody deadly from there. Pick works well there with the defense left a lot to be desired. Yeah, that just comes down to a lack of effort. The defender has to do a better job fighting through the screen. Booker, the pass to bowl. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting, so he'll take two free throws. Hey, you can't block it. Sending him to the line can be the next best thing. You know, Grant, thinking back to those 2021 finals, the Suns coming so close to their first championship. Think about it, B.A. Phoenix had a 2-0 lead over the Bucks, but Giannis then decided to take over. And still, I think that taste of the finals was great for Devin Booker and the Suns. Free throw drops for Bull. And throughout this run, the Warriors' defense has been an underrated part of their success, Richard. And that's what they've got to get back to, especially on the road. Defending at a high level is critical if you're going to get back to the mountaintop. And the Warriors making a change here. Paul's checked in. And Bull drops them both. And here's Paul. Pass to Moody. And here's Sharch. Here's Jackson Davis. Eubanks defending. Jackson Davis with the bucket. Jackson Davis has got six here in the quarter. That scoreless first quarter, that might have woke him up, and he's turned it on here in the second. Gordon outside. Pass to Eubanks. His first shot coming late. It's hauled in by Sharich. And they're doing strong work on the glass. A plus five advantage for them. Here's Moody. And here's Sharich. Bowl covering. Sharich down low. Bowl on him. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. It goes on Bull Bull. Man, the defender really went after him. Dario Two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And the first one at the line is good. Payton's checked in for Moody. And a change for the Suns. Lee's checked in. And both free throws good for Sharich. Yeah, they're playing a much more physical game here in the second quarter. Who poked away. Peyton against Gordon. Count it. Peyton's got five. Credit their discipline. They've been working for high percentage shots. Phoenix has gone four of seven from three during the second quarter. And it's Gary Payton, the second with a foul. That's his first foul of the game. Lee, the pass to Eubanks. Now here's Gordon. And Eric Gordon gets the whistle that time. That's his first foul. Just in this quarter, he's turned it over three times. Not sure what's going on with him. Now Paul. 55 seconds left in the second. Shara to screen. From the high post. Outside Peyton. Pass to Paul. Shot clock at six. And the Warriors with another three. And I love how they're working much harder on the glass this quarter and drumming up more second chance opportunities. 
There's 38 seconds left in the second quarter. Here's Lee. To the paint. Can they get it? He's now one for two with that bucket. Terrific design and execution, leading to an opportunity right at the rim. 26 seconds left in the first half of this one. Now here's Paul. He's covered closely. Again, Golden State. An excellent mid-range shooter. Once Paul gets any kind of airspace, he's taking that shot. Pass to Eubanks. Gordon outside. Over Peyton. And so it's the Golden State Warriors liking their chances. Ending the quarter with a 15-point lead. And they've got a comfortable lead in large part due to their three-point shooting. Back after this. Hello everybody, we're here to break it all down and through the first half of play it's a very commanding lead for the Golden State Warriors. Well they're inflicting major damage from downtown, shooting with a lot of confidence and on the other side that defense looks frustrated. Frustrated? You mean a little bit crispy, I can smell it, barbecue chicken time. Mm-hmm. Now taking a closer look at the first half, how about the performance from these two guys? These two are showing how good they can be. It's not easy to carry a team, but they're doing it. Now the trick is, can both guys carry their teams for a full game? But for what I've seen so far, they might have to. Thanks for joining us. Time to head back over to the third quarter with Brian Anderson. And with the second half upon us, we'll find out if this game becomes the route that it's threatening to be. Stephen Curry having a dominant impact in this game. Yeah, they've done an amazing job of creating room to operate for them. And then, of course, executing. I like how they came into this one with the game plan, and they're just going out and executing it. Terrific job. Second half underway. Here's who Frank Vogel's got on the floor. All the stars on the floor for the Suns. Booker and Beal, the backcourt, and KD up front. Yusuf Nurkic is out there with Grayson Allen. All right, let's check in with Allie LaForce. Brian, the new leadership for the Suns is proving to be aggressive right from the jump. Within days of new ownership taking over, the blockbuster trade for Kevin Durant was executed. The luxury tax bill increased, but the message from the Suns' top brass was we're focused on winning and not money. Money follows success, B.A.? No doubt about that. And with Beal in the mix, they are all in. <laughs> That's how you up the ante. Come right back at him. Yeah, I love the competitive fire right there. You drain a triple on us, and I'm coming for my revenge. Now here's Curry. Out to Thompson. Fires the three. It's hauled in by the Suns. Nurkic has got his fifth rebound in this one. Booker for three. Thompson pulls it in. And so Thompson will bring it up for Golden State. They led by as many as 18. 90 seconds into the second half now. Here's Looney. Oh, denied by Durant. A tremendous defender. Durant's length can cause major issues for the offense. And down it goes. Two points. And he's doing everything he can offensively to lift them out of this hole. But I'm not sure his hot shooting can do it alone. Golden State is gone. Only one of three from deep here in the third. Beal against Thompson. Outside Curry. The three is up. It's not going to go for him. 
trying to get it going. Only one for five to start the second half. Here's Durant. Durant powers through the contact to finish inside. Laser focus from Durant. Nothing comes between him and the bucket. The Warriors have gotten just one of five shots to drop since halftime. And here's Green from the arc. Knocks it down from distance. Green's got five. That's been typical of their performance today. They're sharing the ball and creating good shots. Just under two and a half minutes into this third quarter now. Beal surveying the D. 4-3. Looney grabs a miss. Looney's got 10 rebounds here tonight. So active. Richard, a lot of concern about Klay Thompson coming back from two major injuries. But he's answered those questions. Yeah, it took Klay a little bit of time to get right now. He did miss two seasons. But Thompson was key in that 2022 title run. Then he had a 50-point night in 2023. So, yeah, I'd say he's back. Now here's Booker. He's got 16. Nurkic passes to Durant. Nurkic a screen on green. Clock at six. Nice shot by Durant. And Durant's jumper is as pure as it gets. You just assume ahead of time it's going in. Thompson passes to Green. Here's Looney. Wiggins outside. Pass to Curry. From the arc. And Wiggins gets it to go. The assist by Curry. He's got seven. A dozen consecutive points off of threes. This defense looks rattled. Here's Beal. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. Lots can be said about Bradley Beal's scoring, Grant. But there's more to his game than that. Yeah, B.A., I mean, the shooting is just the most eye-catching part. He also averages solid assist numbers and plays at a high effort level off ball or on defense. Free throw drops for Beal. Well, Grant, Beal traded over the last summer to Phoenix. A new start for him. Yeah, and Beal was the guy for so long with the Wizards. And now he's part of a deadly trio. And you know his numbers, B.A., might drop, but the wins should be much more plentiful. He's perfect from the line this time. What I admire about Beal is his work ethic, his desire to keep improving year after year. Thompson outside. Curry finds Looney. On the wing, Thompson. No good on the three. The Suns have gotten four of seven shots to drop in the third. And it's slammed in by Durant. And it doesn't get any easier for Durant. With his size and length, dunking just comes you know, pretty easy for him. Here's Thompson. Outside, green. Wiggins against Allen. Pass to Curry. Six to shoot. They double-team Curry. Here's Looney. And they're going to count that bucket. And they'll send him to the line. It could be a three-point play. That was just great work to battle through contact and will in the shot. And a moment now to quickly take a look at the offensive approach for the Warriors. All game long, they've been making it rain from the arc. And look, they've done it by feeding the hot hands. Well, in addition, I love their passing. I mean, they're buying into that team concept. That's hard to get out of your young guys. And that one misses. And to even things out for free agents from year to year. The league now has something called cap smoothing, RJ. In the past, free agents in a year with a big cap spike would get a lot more money than free agents in the other years. This is an attempt to even it out so we don't have the same thing happen back in 2017. Saw the angles and led him right to the hoop with that pass.
Golden State has got four of eight attempts to fall from deep here in the third quarter. Hooker against Curry. Thompson outside. Fires the three. Knocks down the long J. Thompson's got his second basket on the night. They've been pretty lax with their perimeter defense, giving up a lot of three-pointers. Durant inside, hounded by Wiggins. Nice shot by Durant. And now, almost all their points coming from the paint. And so Curry will bring it up for Golden State. Timeout called, the Warriors. And something fans don't always get to see. Some of the closely guarded secrets that happen in that huddle. And we see it so often. One little tweak to the game plan and everything falls into place for a team. Both teams changing it up here. And with this pause, a check on the stats to show you which teams led the league in assists last year. The Warriors, number one. The fourth spot held by the Suns. During last season, both of these teams were just unselfish, piling up the assist. And it's the Warriors with the ball. The lead is 15. Here's Pachinski. That drops. And it comes off an assist from Curry. Curry's got six assists now in the game. The Suns have gone 7 of 10 here in the second half. Left side Durant. Wing shot on the way. The rebound by Moody. And he's very confident from that range. But he can't make him off. Pass to Pajimski. Outside Curry. Launches a three. The Suns clear it. Durant's got five rebounds in the game. And he gets the jumper to drop. Durant's got 12 points here in the second half. For his sake, I hope they can come back. You hate to see the performance he's having be wasted in a loss. Pass to Moody. And he'll draw the foul. He'll head to the line for two. First personal foul. Second team foul. At the line for the Warriors. Moses Moody. And he makes a first. And the Warriors making a switch here. Kuminga's checked in. Bowl, he's checked in for Phoenix. Little comes in for Bradley Beal. So he picks up just one from the line that time. 
The Suns have gone 8 of 12 from the floor in the third quarter. Little passes to Metu. Outside Booker. It's Metu. High post. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. It's going to be on Jonathan Kuminga. Man, good whistle there. Shooting for Phoenix. Chemezi Metu. Two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. First one falls. Chris Paul, he's checked in for the Warriors. And he makes both free throws. And they've done well from the free throw line this half. No misses yet. And so it's Paul who brings up the ball for the Warriors. Down low. Here's Kuminga. And Metu pulls it down. Phoenix has gone only one of three from deep here in the third. Booker against Paul. Here's Nurkic. That one's good. Give the assist to Booker. Assistant. Booker's got three assists tonight. Uh, so capable of overwhelming you. Nurkic is terrific at maintaining his focus and balance on these tough finishes. Now here's Paul. Nine points in the game. Pass to Pajimski for three. And it's Phoenix with the rebound. Nurkic has got ten rebounds here tonight. So active. Outside Booker. Beal outside. Down to five on the shot clock. There's a screen by Nurkic. Let's go with a three. And Beal hits it from deep. Beal's got five points now in the quarter. A volume three-point shooter. Beal knows he has the green light to shoot threes whenever he wants. Pass to Moody. Here's Pajemski. Outside Kaminga. Paul for three. Give him that one. Now shooting five for 11 from the floor. Doesn't come back and fire threes very often. Paul answers that time. Richard, looking at Chris Paul's career up until this point, he's someone that makes every team he's on better. Yeah, it's because he's just such a great leader. Someone that commands excellence, not just from himself, but his teammates and his entire organization. Here's Moody. And here's Kaminga for three. Durant pulls it in. Pass to Booker. And here's Nurkic for three. Bajimski grabs the board. Bajimski's got his fifth rebound in this one. Shoots over Beal. And the foul is called. He missed it, so he's got a couple of free throws coming his way. It's going to be on Bradley Beal. At the line for the Dubs. The first free throw is good. Charich checks in for the Warriors. Clay Thompson comes in for Moody. Good on the second, so he makes them both. And Phoenix has possession. Down by 15. 
Gordon against Thompson. Pass to Eubanks. No luck on that one. Sharich with some nice D. And the Warriors shooting about 47% on the third. Ball with it. Out to Thompson. Thompson with a screen. And there's a whistle. He'll head to the line to shoot two. Second personal foul. Team sports. At the line, home for you. That free throw, no good. Their lead could be even bigger right now. But their efficiency from the line has dropped off a little. And the Warriors making a change here. And the second free throw is good. Now here's Gordon. Give him eight. Two minutes remaining in the third. Two minutes. There's a minute 54 left in the third. Lee drills it from deep. You can't lose a shooter like him on the court. The ball will find its way to him, and he will drill a three each time. 146 left in the third quarter. Here's Pajemski. He has six. Pass to Sharich. Three-pointer. Hits the trifecta. Sharich has got ten. Their strategy has been pretty simple here in the second half. Attack from three-point range. And you see this so much more nowadays in the NBA. Teams putting a larger emphasis on jacking up threes. Here's Okogi. It's a 16-point game. And the Warriors making a switch here. Hayden's checked in. And the Suns also making a change. Allen, he's checked in for a Kogi. Here's Lee. Allen on the wing. He's guarded by Paul. Shoots it from the high post. Allen can't get it to go. And it's Paul with the ball for the Warriors. Sharich finds Paul. Sharich, a screen on Allen. Paul with it. Guarded now by Bull. Paul against Allen. And he banks in the layup. Give him eight points now. It's interesting. They definitely had more three-point attempts in the first half. Not sure why they went away from it. There's 48 seconds left to play in the third quarter. Pass to Jackson Davis. To the middle. Here's Sharich. Oh, and makes it with the kiss. Sharich has got five points in the quarter. Taking it right at the rack. I mean, that defense is looking real frustrated. That's the kind of aggression you want to see when you've got a team on the ropes. And Phoenix has possession. After the Warriors picking up a basket just a moment ago. Lee, the pass to Allen. Pass to Bowl. And so he draws the foul, headed to the line to shoot a pair. Shooting for Phoenix. Bowl, bowl. Taking two shots. First one falls for him.
No good on the second free throw. They've had a slight leg up on the boards and a big leg up on the scoreboard. Sharich, the pass to Paul. Payton with a screen on Gordon. Back to Sharich. Over Bull. Oh, and he hits it at the buzzer. Great job ending the quarter on a high note. That's the play that pumps up the whole team, and they'll try to carry that energy into the next period. And as we end the third quarter, a double-digit deficit will make it tough to come back. The Warriors on top, leading by 17. And time to step away quickly, but we'll be back in no time with the start of the fourth quarter. And now we take a listen in to a recent huddle from Frank Vogel. Poise and aggressiveness on the offensive end. Everything we do is through speed and force on the offensive end. Frank Vogel clearly would like to see these guys attack the defense a little more, but also avoid costly mistakes. And this is where I think you want to keep things simple. Make the right cut, the right pass. Don't worry about the style. Just score. And as we head into the fourth, we'll see if there's a comeback in the works or if it's more of the same for the first three quarters. Wiggins at the three with Draymond at the four. CP3 and Clay team up in the backcourt. And it's Looney in at the five. So that's the group out there for Golden State. Thompson's shot is off. And the Suns shooting it well, around 55% for the game. Beal with it. Beyond the arc. The Warriors pull it in. Looney's got 11 rebounds in the game. Green finds Paul. Now Thompson. Tries to save it. And the Suns pushing it up now. Booker for three. Ooh, Booker from range. Pure. Yes, yeah, so good to see Booker knocking down the corner triple. A go-to score with considerable range. And the Warriors with possession. They led by as many as 18. Pass to Paul. Back to Thompson. Wiggins outside. Four on the clock. The shot, no good. Nice D from Allen. Phoenix has gone one of two from deep in this quarter. And Nurkic throws it down. Great decision making from Booker. Realizing one of his guys is open and whips the pass to him. Boy, you love how guys are making plays for one another here. Yeah, just a balanced attack, a total team effort. Looney passes to Thompson. Oh, Clay Thompson delivers. And trust me, when the D's slow to react, he'll be the first guy to make them pay. Yeah, they're going to do a much better job of putting a little bit of pressure on him on his way to the hoop. Booker against Paul. And here's Nurkic. Pass to Booker. The three. It doesn't go for him. And here's Thompson. He'll bring it up for the Warriors. A 12-point game. Ball against Booker. Paul passes to Thompson. Wiggins outside to the left side wing. Six on the shot clock. Looney, a screen on Booker. Pulls it in from the elbow. Second chance shot. The shot by Looney, no good. For Phoenix, they've gone three of five since this fourth quarter started. Beal outside. Fades back. And the Suns get it back. Kevin Durant, unfazed by the D. Seems like Durant barely has to jump between his height, his long arms. It just makes the putback so easy. Time call here. Timeout. The Warriors decide to talk it over. And this late game timeout, getting a breather here, important for the players to recharge. This is where you have a chance to get rehydrated with some Gatorade.
He's checked in for Chris Paul. And let's swing it over to the sideline and hear from Allie. During that break, Coach Steve Kerr had some advice for the team. He said to his guys, this one is not over yet. You have worked hard for this lead, and we are not about to give it up now. Stay focused and keep hustling. Back to you guys. All right, appreciate it, Allie. Finds Green. Left side Curry. Wiggins outside. That drops. And it comes off an assist from Curry. Adds to their lead. They've been able to rely on him all night. Booker against Curry. There's a screen by Nurkic. This one for three. Fires in the triple. Nurkic has got five points now in the quarter. Man, this is just fun. These teams are trading threes back and forth. This is today's NBA. Hey, we see this kind of exchange more often than not. Now here's Thompson. The kick out, Curry. Thompson outside. Five to shoot. Takes the three. Another three for Golden State. His third triple of the game. A little more success from out there in the second half. Nurkic, a screen on Curry. Pass to Durant. Oh, a clear foul there on the missed shot. So he'll get a pair at the line. Kevon Looney picks one up. Such a skilled, versatile talent. When Durant is focused on scoring, he's hard to guard without fouling. The line for two. And he knocks down the first one. Both free throws good for Durant. Golden State has gone two of two from outside so far in the fourth. Looney, a screen on Booker. The three from Curry. The Suns clear it. He didn't make them pay for that weak defense, but they just can't rely on him to miss those kind of shots. Here's Durant. Had a chance there to cut it to single digits, but it's off target. Wiggins passes to Curry. Back to Wiggins. And here's Thompson for three. Good. That's his fifth bucket in nine attempts. Man, they're having a hard time defending the triple. That's three in a row. Thompson against Beal. Pass to Nurkic. Now here's Booker. The three. Oh, Booker answers the three right back. He hit three triples in the first half. Three more since. <laughs> That's nothing to shrug at. And so Thompson will bring it up for the Warriors. They lead by 11. Outside Curry. Here's the three. Rebounded by Nurkic. Nurkic has got 13 rebounds in the game. Glass eating. Booker against Curry. And it's Beal penetrating. And another basket for Phoenix. And he's been much more assertive here in the second half. Getting to his spots, executing with ease. Outside, Green. Pass to Looney. Now Curry. Wiggins with it. Fires for three. Rebounded by Nurkic. Nurkic has got 14. Yep, 14 rebounds for him tonight. Beal with it. Now guarded by Curry. Nurkic to screen on Curry. Three-pointer. Beal. The Warriors pull it in. 
Looney's got rebound number 15 here tonight. Wiggins finds Thompson. Pass to Curry. Fires the three. And again for three. Buries his 10th triple of the game. Unbelievable, B.A. Unbelievable. Nurkic to screen on Thompson. Here's Beal. That doesn't go either for Beal. Yeah, you have to knock those down. Open shots inside the arc are rare in this league. Curry passes to Thompson. And here is Green. Now Curry. Pass to Looney. Thompson outside. Another three for Golden State. Wow, five consecutive threes. This defense looking very frustrated right now. Time Phoenix out, time calls out. timeout. Man, it's been quite a game for Stephen Curry. They really need to reshape their defense. They have to get out to him quicker to slow his three-point attack. for the Suns. On defense, the Warriors. They led by as many as 18. Booker finds Durant. Yes! And it's Booker with the setup. Durant's got seven points here in the quarter. He was solid in the first half from deep. He's a guy who can get hot. Let's see how he does here in the second. The Warriors have gotten six of their 13 shots to go. The three from Curry. Durant pulls it in. Durant's got rebound number nine now. What an effort here tonight. Curry against Booker. Over Curry. Hauled in by Curry. That's the shot they wanted. It just didn't fall. Tough to watch those miss. I'm sure they'll convert the next chance. Allen with it. Now Thompson defending. Allen outside. Outside Booker. Pass to Durant. Just five to shoot. Out of bounds, it'll go to the Warriors. Chris Paul, he's checked in for the Warriors. And it's Green with the ball for Golden State. A 12-point game. Wiggins outside. Paul against Booker. Thompson outside. And the Warriors miss again. And that's exactly how tightly you have to guard him every time he steps to the arc. He's just that good. 
Here's Durant. Oh, Durant playing big in the paint. Even if this game doesn't go their way, he has to be proud of his performance tonight. Now here's Paul. Pass to Thompson. Beyond the arc. It's hauled in by the Suns. Outside Booker. Now Allen. Cole, a screen on Paul. Here's Allen. Shot clock at six. The Suns need to get off a shot. Booker for three. Another three for Phoenix. Part of the evolution of Booker's game, getting consistent from deep. They can take their time if they want. Yes. You have time to out, regroup. Make sure you get a good shot. Timeout called. The Warriors. and outside. To stop the drought. Chalk up two there. Thompson's got 16 in the second half. <laughs> They're going at it on offense. Neither team backing down. Man, this has been a fun one, but look, who doesn't love a high-scoring game? Beal outside. Bull, a screen on Thompson. Beal finds Bull. Over Looney. That's good from Bull. On the assist by Beal. <laughs> this has been fun to watch. I mean, they've managed to go on a run just when it looked like this might be over. The Warriors leading. Thompson scanning the floor. Outside Paul. Pass to Green. Ball against Booker. Ball passes to Green. Shot clock at five. Looney the screen from about 19. And Looney with the slam. Running offense through Green isn't just an option. It's a preference. Beal against Thompson. Now here's Beal. Guarded closely. And the Suns getting another bucket right there. A minute 15 left in the fourth quarter. And the Warriors shooting 44% here in the fourth quarter. Here's Looney. 
Outside Paul. Six to shoot. Thompson, a screen on Allen. Wiggins from long range. The Suns clear it. Things aren't looking good here. I mean, they need points, and they need them now. And if I were them, I'd start thinking about where I'm going to get food after the game because this one looks a bit out of reach. Now here's Wiggins. Throws it up high. Yes, and it's Paul with the assist that time. And the Warriors lead by nine. You see the strength that Wiggins has added over the years. He can take on pretty much anyone at this point. And he gets that one. And it's Paul with the ball for the Warriors. No need to shoot. This one is done. Yes, they've got to be happy with tonight's effort. And so the Warriors take the win. This one was in the balance right until the final seconds. NBA, they showed their character when it mattered most. Sending those fans home happy. All right, let's go courtside to Ali LaForce with our player of the game. Ali, it's all yours. Steph, I know it's still early, but how do you evaluate this team and its ability to go the distance? Uh, in terms of communicating about our principles and how we're going to be successful, trying to change the championship, we're definitely uh, on the same page. It's a matter of staying focused every night, giving the best effort we can, and just you know, enjoying the journey because it's a long year. Well, you've been there. You know what it takes. Thanks, Steph. All right, Allie, good stuff there. Thanks for that. And that about does it for the first game of the new NBA season. This is Brian Anderson, along with our 2K Sports crew, thanking you for tuning in. And now we present the New Balance player of the game, Stephen Curry.